Hello and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jill and I enjoy sharing different beauties, tips, tricks, and more and all about different things in lifestyle. So there may be some recipes, some travel, some crafts, who knows, it's just a variety of things as I am changing the direction of this a little bit this year in 2024. So in a previous video, when I did a five below haul, I promised you all that I was going to do a little review and test of their nail polishes. Now I've never used this particular brand before and I'm curious to see how well it goes on and how long it stays on. So this video will take a couple days to put together, but for you, it will be in a matter of minutes. So I'm gonna show you the process of putting it on, let you know what the colors and everything are, and then giving my review about how well they did. Um, also, I am going to be using the top coat and base coat from Ollie and June because they're the ones that I have on hand, so I'll be putting them together with it. And just something else to remember when putting on your nail polish. I always like to have some Q-tips along with my nail polish remover. That way, if I have any mistakes along the way, it's easy to do the touch-ups right then and there. So let's get started and see what I think about these nail polishes. Okay, so I'm going to first start with priming my nails and getting them all ready for all these beautiful colors that we're going to try. And I just like to keep like a little washcloth or something underneath when I'm doing my nails just in case there's any mishaps. Um, so as you see, I'm going to go ahead and add this on here and get ready for the color to start in just a few moments. <laughs> This is the first pretty color that they offer, but unfortunately they do not put any names on the bottle, so I'm really not able to tell you what specific colors that they are. Um, I'm just going to go through each one. This one went okay, on okay for a light one. Um, the coverage was a little strange, but I put a couple coats on and it ended up turning out a little bit better. <laughs> This is the next pretty color. I really like this one. It's a nice neutral color. It would go with a lot of different outfits and great for an everyday look. So this went on pretty well also. This was a nice fun hot pink color and it's probably even better for this summertime of course, but I did want to go ahead and demonstrate it since it came in this packet. Like I said, these lean toward more fall colors, I guess, but I still think they're really pretty and wanted to feature them. This is a really pretty color as well. Definitely a fall color, but I feel like it could go into the winter time as well. And then we have a mauve, which goes with everything. And then we have a nice lighter color again to finish it up. So I'm just going to add this on and complete the looks and then go ahead and do the same thing on the other hand until I have all the colors used up and ready to go. We're going to complete everything with the top coat and this just helps to hold everything on and we're going to see how this does over the next couple of days and then I will do a follow-up video on Friday to show you what I think and give you a little review over how it all went. And these are the completed look of all the colors. I do wish that they had the names on the bottom of the bottle so I could let you guys know what they are but this is the best I can do. Here's a little closer look of all of them. So I did my nails on Monday and did each color from five below. So I'm going to show you the result. Today is Friday. I waited a few days to do these. And you guys, I have to say, I am pretty impressed. I have not done any touch-ups, nothing. And I can assure you I've been doing dishes, I've even like been using my nails to pull things and so forth. And they really look really nice, like it's almost the same as the first day. So I'm really impressed by that. Now I did use the Ali and June um, primer and also top coat. So I don't know if that would have made a difference or not. 
but I would think if they weren't halfway decent nail polishes that they wouldn't have held up this well. So this is a definite plus. I would definitely say I would probably buy them again. They got a lot of cute colors in there. And coming up for summer and spring, there's all different pastels and stuff that are in there. So I think I'm definitely going to give them a try again. So let me know what you think in the comments below. Is this a nail brand that you would use or try? What are your thoughts about it? And what colors do you like? I hope you guys have an absolutely amazing day. As you see, we have more rain here in Florida. <laughs> I'm so used to having sun all the time. So sometimes it's nice to have a little bit of rain and just a good day to read or catch up on stuff that you don't normally get to do around the house because you're always outside. So I hope you guys enjoy and have a wonderful weekend and I will be back here real soon with another makeup haul to show you.